The interest and the commitment to do something in politics has to really be strong. And we need the best of the young people we can possibly have now more than ever before, I think. I knew going into college that I really wanted to get involved in politics and never had put much thought into Iowa being a great place for politics. Of course, I thought of all the stereotypical places like D.C. and New York. If I wanted to do political science, I needed to either be in Iowa or Washington, D.C. I saw that politics had an effect on like our lives much more than just the general election and who comes to president. And I saw that the potential of politics to help people. Once I read about the Culver Public Policy Center, it seemed like the best way to get involved in politics at my young age. The Culver Center is a public policy center that offers extraordinary opportunities to students who are interested in service and politics. The Culver Fellowship is a competitive application. We receive 30 to 40 applications per year. Prove that you have an interest in politics or public service or public policy and actually be active in that kind of field and career to warrant becoming a Culver Fellow. It could be from political science to even management or marketing or economics or business majors. Uh, I think there might even be a theater major in our group. This year's incoming class of 14 represents the cream of the crop of an outstanding group of applicants. I've had the privilege of knowing more of them you know, over the years and all of them impressed me uniformly and I've just enjoyed the opportunity to hopefully encourage some of them to get involved in politics, create an interest in a positive way. Culver Fellows have great opportunities to serve as leaders on campus to engage their fellow students in the political process. It's really hard to peg down just one specific experience because it's been a continuous, non-stop experience. I was able to attend a Harvard conference as an ambassador from Simpson on voter engagement. Right when I arrived on campus, we hosted the Congressional and U.S. Senate debates here in the Kent Center. To hear all the people at Harvard know who Simpson was, just a small liberal arts college in Indianola, Iowa, it was one of the coolest, most surreal experiences. Getting younger people involved through voter registration. I got to go to Washington, D.C and see Senator, former Senator Harkin's office and meet with Senator Grassley. So I was able to work on human trafficking issues. I was able to work on policies at the state level and intern on campaigns. Got a tour from an older fellow who was interning in D.C. of the Capitol building. I think some of the best parts have been actually talking with Senator Culver and Mary Jane. Their stories are very inspirational. When I was introducing Ann Seltzer, and it was at that moment that I just realized that this was one of the major pollsters in the whole country, and I was able to introduce her. That is only something that a Culver Fellow gets to do. Which will allow you to capitalize on those small school opportunities, but also the opportunities of being in a major metro area like Des Moines, especially when it comes to politics, where we are the center of the political universe every four years. I've had the opportunity to meet nearly every presidential candidate, both of our senators. It just seems like the opportunities are absolutely endless. Culver Fellows at Simpson have tremendous opportunities to land coveted internships, summer jobs, and clerkships in a variety of settings. Since I've graduated from Simpson, uh, I'm actually sitting here in the U.S. Embassy in, of Djibouti, and I have been able to intern, uh, intern there in the public diplomacy section of the embassy. One of my future goals is to eventually join the Peace Corps. I'd really like to work as a teaching English or working in community building. I attend law school after Simpson. And I'm going to become a Fulbright in Malaysia. So I will serve as an English language assistant for the 2017 academic year. I really hope that I can get a job in the courts some way, in some way, shape, or form. Ultimately, I want to become a judge. That's like my top end goal. So I think I can get there. It's really great to see what doors the Culver Center will end up opening for you. Because of the Culver Center, I was able to make a lot of connections that I wouldn't have done otherwise. Because of the Culver Center, because of the directors, because of the support system. That's what it is. It's the community from your professors to your fellow students. It's just kind of like your family. It really makes anything possible for you, and it really enriches your life. It makes your Simpson experience uh, something to fight for, and it's fulfilling. Other skills that I've learned other than which fork is the salad fork, <laughs> um, are learning how to work as part of a team, just as the Culver Center is a huge team effort and each person needs to do their part in order to get the big picture to happen. If you care about government, if you care about social issues, if you care about changing the world, that's what it's all about, really, is finding your passion and the Culver Center helps you find that passion and also gives you the resources to follow it through.